What's going on, family? New day, new beginnings. Before we get started, hit that like and share button and subscribe to Truth TR2. What I wanted to briefly discuss, as you can see by the thumbnail, you got Scotty Pippen, um, his ex wife, you got um, PJ Tucker, his baby mother, and you got Zion. And the name of the thumbnail is No End in Sight. And the reason why I named it that way is because it's been going on for ages, decades. Where these athletes, mostly a lot of NBA players, they wipe up these women who have no value. And you basically know what the woman is there for. But I'm not sure if they think what they're doing is going to change their mindset. You're an athlete. That's one. You know, if you want to get married, have your side pieces, all be it. But a lot of these dudes fall in love. And when you fall in love, that's the number one mistake um, you can make, especially when you fall in love with a woman who's not solid. You know, when you look at, you know, Scottie Pippen, you know, he's been with his wife, Larza Pippen, for how long? They got four kids, but she's very trifling, you know, they divorced and so forth, you know, but you getting banged on a yacht or a boat, you know, by future. You're dealing with Malik Beasley, a player in the NBA, disrespecting this man. Now you with Michael Jordan's son. You know, that tells you a lot about the character of the woman, but I'm going to say this, right? Scottie Pippen passed, he had multiple women, and that woman probably just eventually got fed up, and she's just doing her. So I'm not going to blame. He's a simp, and let it be. When it comes to P.J. Washington now, you know, you knew Brittany, Brittany Renner was a bird, you know, and you still dealt with it. If you're going to deal with something like that, homie, hit it and dip. I say this all the time, I'm not sure how these dudes fall in love, man. Just hit it on a dip. But we got to understand, a lot of these athletes are simps. A lot of them are betas. You know, they soft and everything. The only thing that they have, the only thing they can really hold on is the NBA accolades, the college accolades, and the high school accolades. You know, Brittany Renner, she knew what she was doing because she's older than, older than PJ. But PJ is so damn dumb, you go go seat it up. You know, you seat it up now, and you paying the wazoo out your ass of child support. That's a killer. Especially when you're young, you're now getting your foot in. And then eventually, on top of that, I think after a year, he go propose to some chick. These dudes, these dudes this this guy here just doesn't learn. You know, so you got to leave him alone because he's hard is. You know, now it comes to Zion. It's sad that I think it's three women now or four, whatever it is. They coming out with all these um, um, tweets, um, IG posts in regards to going at them. For one... I mean, come on, who really was choosing up on Zion? You know, you got to buy it. And I'm not saying buying it is wrong, but that just goes to show he has no game. It is what it is. A lot of these guys out here buy sex. I'm not mad at them. Let them be. But, you know, you can't be so stupid or foolish to not have, you know, an NDA like all these athletes have and entertainers. You know, and that's why Mariah Mills is being so damn reckless now because you can't muzzle her. And by not muzzling her, you know, all your business being put out there. You know, Zion is a typical young man. You know, he's infatuated with the, the IG culture, the Facebook culture, and the OnlyFans culture. So you can't, I can't really be mad at him because that's this generation mindset. They look at these women and seem that these women are women of high character. And a lot of them are women of low character. You just got to have someone there that could guide you. And when you look at Zion's situation, there's no one guiding him. PJ, no one guided him. Pippen, at that point in time, he was grown, so he 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 knew what he was doing, you know? So he just soaking his oats right now because he knew what he was doing. But all three of these guys, it's going to continue because there's always simps in the league. There's simps coming into the league, and there's young simps and old simps. But we just got to understand that you can't be got so easily. You got to, you know, have some alpha qualities about you. But I think Jason Black said this on one of his programs. He said a lot of guys are alphas in money, but, you know, socially they betas. And that's how it is. But all three of these guys here, man, they got took. They paying child support up the wazoo. Now I'm Zion, not yet, because um, his baby mother... You know, she's not going to do it yet. You know, she secured the bag and she's going to run with it eventually. But it's sad because all three of them are black. And they're not realizing that the fortune that they giving away to women 
who have low character. And we're going to have a lot of them coming up doing the same, giving away generational wealth to low character women. But family, hit that like and share button and subscribe to Truth TR2.